Tuesday, May 14th, 2013. I am inmate number 1776. This is my second day of fasting. Um, the second day has been um, a little tougher than the first day in the morning, uh, but I haven't, I haven't felt hungry in the last few hours, so it's, um, it's getting a little bit better. Uh, I'm hoping that the third and fourth day are something like this, but I know it's not going to be. <laughs> it's going to, it's going to start um, going into the stomach cramps and all that good stuff, and then slowly but surely I'm going to lose power in all of my limbs and slow down a whole lot and lose all my body mass, the little that I have. <laughs> As I keep repeating, but it's true. It's going to be a pretty fast process. But I'm going to keep it going, and we'll see if we can outlast the media and challenge the media into doing something about this, informing the American public um, any way they can so that we can put some pressure on the politicians to give, uh, extend the right to a fair trial to those prisoners, or um, in the like, greatest outcome we, we would have would be would, to close the prison down completely, but we'll see what they do over the next few days. Are you uh, totally on water now? Uh, not yet. I'll be, um, the day after tomorrow, I'll be completely on water. Completely on water then? Yeah. Right now, it's just been basically like juice and like Powerade, pretty much. And I'm going to, I've been kind of cutting that today. I drink some water, but tomorrow I've got to do half and half at least. So the day after, I can be cut down on my carbs. I just wanted to make sure I didn't crash early or anything and actually get my body somewhat used to that getting too many nutrients. Right. <clears throat> um, has it affected your sleep yet at all? Uh, I couldn't sleep last night because I was hungry, but um, uh, I'm not really feeling too hungry right now, so I'm hoping that this, <laughs> this continues for a little while, as long <laughs> as possible, because tomorrow and the day after kind of worry me. Um, but yeah, it's it's... It definitely changes everything up because you normally, I mean, this is America, you know, <laughs> it's like you normally don't go without food unless you make yourself do it. Right. So, it's, uh, um, I mean, I know some people are hungry, but it's, it's like, it's a lot easier to get food here than I think a lot of people in the world deal with every day. Right. Absolutely. And like, we're very close to, um, a lot of. Uh, access to food, so right. it makes Whether it a lot easier for us. Dumpster diving or going <laughs> yeah. to a food shelter yeah. place or, yeah. Right. All right, well, we will check back in with you tomorrow and see how it's going tomorrow. Thanks, I look forward to it. Peace.